Merci beaucoup. Okay, hold your breath on this. This is a very long dream he has, so <laughs> be prepared to break it down into sentences and divisions. <laughs> Okay, we go. I see a dog below me sniffing around a traffic signal pole. <clears throat> That's the whole thing. Want to read it again? <laughs> I, I see a dog below me sniffing around a traffic signal pole. Bada bing, okay. bada boom. Um, who's going to analyze it? What was that seeing life, seeing the dog? That's your question, isn't it? Yeah, what do you want to do? What's he mean below him? Yeah, it's, it was like I was standing here in the pole, and the dog is right at my feet, and it's kind of curled around the pole, but this pole is going up, and I think there's a traffic, a th the three lights at the top of the pole. That's a semaphore? Yeah, and that's it. So he's like right here, below me, at my feet. And his body is kind of curled around the pole, like he's kind of wrapped around it a little. Sniffing. What would you do with that, Julie? Yeah, I'd ask, what was that like, seeing that? Yeah, okay, that's a similar question with Virginia. Go ahead. Well, it's a good question. Um, I'm not, I, um, I don't remember any emotional state or any surprise or any, um, okay. it was more just like a witnessing. It came and went and I wo actually I woke up right after this uh, in my bed. So uh, the dog was sniffing around. Yeah. What did you see at that moment? What did I see? Yeah. Yeah, you're sniffing around. What did that tell you in the dream? See, this whole, it, it almost came like a flash. It was like a one or two second dream. So there was almost no time to even make judgments or questions like that no. in the dream itself. That's okay. But... I am not sure if it was in the dream. Maybe I, I think I thought about it afterwards. I'm thinking, well, what he's doing is he's kind of sniffing around the bottom for he's going to pee. Mm -hmm. Like, has anybody? I mean, he's doing what dogs obviously do. Has anybody else been here? I better mark my territory. Or maybe he's figuring out who was here. But. He wasn't lying. Yeah, he was. He was on his feet, but he was kind of. His body was kind of curled around. It was kind of wrapped around the pole, in kind of a C shape as he's going around it. So, if there was, to answer your guys' question, if there was anything at all, there might have been a slight curiosity that came to. You know, like why? Yeah, what, what's he doing? Why is it? 
and why is he shaped that way? Why is he so? But it. it What's yeah, but it, it, what's he doing? Yeah, but it 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 just all came and went so fast. Um, it's it's almost as if the way this dream came, it was so fast. It was like a one second or two second dream. It was like a flash. I have no time to think about it, and then I wake up in my bed. Yeah. No, no. Say, um, you mentioned it had uh, lights on top of the... Yeah. Yeah. You know, did you find that curious? I did, yes. Yeah. I do. Yeah, what do you make of that? What kind of lamp is that that has three lights? It's like one of the kind that they hang from intersections with red, yellow, and green, except that hanging by a wire, instead of hanging by a wire, it's at the top of this pole. It's on top of the pole. Yeah, and right. it's, you know, there are three vertical. Yeah. With a yellow metal casing to the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. I guess. Yeah. And that's really an exception. The, you know, they have them in cities on poles like that, yeah. but it's more common that they're, yeah. yeah. Not that common around here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, what? Do, see, that's a very interesting uh, arrangement. It's signaling for traffic, right? And the dog is wrapped around the bottom of it. Yes. Yeah. And what's odd about the scene is, even now, as I look back, there is absolutely. Uh, there is a complete absence of any background detail. Mm -hmm. It's as white as this board. Mm -hmm. So that's what you have is the dog, the pole, the light, mm -hmm. boom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. By the way, what kind of dog? Not even a street. Yeah, what kind of dog? Um, it's brown, it's um, short haired, kind of plump. You know, about, I don't know, that big, a foot and a half, eight inches wide, ten, you know, short, short-legged. You know, what, what do you think of dogs like that? Uh, did it invite, uh, to, were you attracted to it, like to pet it, or? No. It, no. So, it's a different kind of dog, isn't it? I, uh, honestly, I, I don't, I mean, it is right at my feet, but I'm not even sure it is my dog that's, in, in that's this good. dream. That's okay. But it um, is a brown, short-haired, foot-and-a-half dog. No positives or negatives associated no. with it, no judgments. No, no. Uh, by the way, is he, a, uh, in some sense, a pedigree or a mixed? What do you notice about the nature of the dog? Because you, you know, said what's, something curious what's about him. the thing is, what's interesting is the dog himself is also difficult to describe because, by virtue of my being above him, I'm only seeing the back and the and the top of the head. So it's, I don't even see the face of this thing. Mm -hmm. So I couldn't answer whether it's pedigreed or not because. Yeah, okay, but you did say uh, short legged. Yes. By virtue of its height off the ground, yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, th again, uh, pedigree, <laughs> uh, a mutt. Come on, I need a couple of words. I know. I got to give you something, right? Yeah. Um. Like, like, common, uncommon. I, I, I want to say it leans more towards mutt or common, uh, but I'm not even sure if it has a collar on it. No, it okay. certainly doesn't have a leash. Right. Uh, it doesn't look dirty. It looks clean, so it must be living with someone who takes care of it. Um, it, it could go either way. It could be one of these 
I mean, it could be a mutt, and I just don't, you know, it's a mix of something, or it could be, it could be one of these, um, yeah, it could be. <laughs> That's good. I just, yeah. we're just adding some nice things to it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, no leash. But he's sniffing. He's he's working his way. He's like really. He's really working on that puzzle of whatever he's sniffing on the pole. And you can see he has no leash, no uh, identification. No, and if but I he's not dirty. He's clean. It shows that he's been taken care of. Yeah. Um, what's the word? Therefore, in what condition would you say the dog is in without a master? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, indeed. Yeah, we got it. Go ahead. Well. Well, what it vaguely reminds me now is I think at the very, very beginning of the dream, there's a flash that like, all of a sudden he came up in front of me, and it did surprise me. And I think he belonged to somebody else. Now that I think about it. Yeah. But at this but point, that was just this. But at this point, he's without a master. Yeah, they're really not in the picture. Yeah. Uh, Therefore, what would you say about the dog? He's 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 on his own. He's on his own. Yeah. Right. Thank you. What's another name for that? Um, wild or um, lost. He's been he's been uh, he's off the leash. And he's exploring, but he's um, he's not in con he's not in control. He's n someone is um, uh, well. Again, this is a, it's a white background, but assuming we're in a city, he yeah. should be on a leash. Yeah. 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 He's on his own. Could be lost. Could be wild. He's off the leash. He's not in in anyone's control. Right, right, right. Could you put that positively then? Uh, he's not growling. No. He's, he's sniffing not, around, ready to be. He's not dangerous. Not dangerous. Uh, could you put that positively as well? Is he free? Um, yes, he's free to do what he's doing right now. Ah, he's, he's, ah, he has a curiosity, whatever that is. Right. Right. You're looking at a free, curious being. And what's interesting about the oh. fact that the pole has lights on the top is that it, the fact that it has lights on the top would, would be completely irrelevant to the dog. It's not part of the dog's world, right? That's a human thing. Mm -hmm. So he's, the lights are up here for us, but he's down there mm -hmm. below me. Oh. He's indifferent to yeah. the lights. He's indifferent to the lights. Yeah. That completely, almost yeah. like the master-slave thing we just did. Right. right, that's right. That's right. Yeah. Wow. That's right. And what, yeah. What's interesting in the dream is that all the lights are off. Therefore, they're not functioning. They're not functioning, yeah. So in the, the, the human realm, it's just not functioning. It's not functioning. The lights are off. No, no, no. But he's free. He's being guided by his own sense of curiosity. But in some sense, it seems like a really ridiculous, like from my point of view, yeah, whatever you're going to do, bud. You want to sniff for somebody else's pee and mark your territory, go for it. But it's, it's so down there from where I am, at least in the dream. But... But on the other hand, come on, 
given the qualities you're giving him. But I, yeah, yeah, exactly. By the same token, on the other hand, there wasn't anything wrong with it. He's doing, you know, there's a, there's a certain perfection to it. He's doing what he's doing at yeah. his level. Yeah, 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 so, right. Right, a certain perfection on this level. And if there is anything I do notice about the back, it's not just that his hair is clean and short, but it, it has a very, um, it's very, uh, I don't know how you describe, it's just very orderly. It's as if someone had combed it. It's very well kept hair. Although it's so short. See that adds. Yeah, and you did ask me that before. I right. should have added that. Yep, yep. Yeah. So he's well kept, but now he's free. And his hair is, I can see around the edges, it's beige. It's, it's like this brownish red on the top, but around the sides, it's more beige-ish. Mm -hmm. So it has a two-tone. That's kind of nice. What did that tell you? There's a beauty to him. Mm-hmm. What kind? I mean, a little bit, half a bit. Um, There's some beauty to it, right? To this being. All right. Yeah. No. Yeah. He's not only free and curious and on his own. He's well kept. He's free of his master. He's doing what he wants to do. There's a certain beauty to it. There's mm -hmm. a certain perfection on this level that he's functioning on. And you're looking at that. You're watching that, right? Yeah, why am I seeing that? Yeah, well, it's... Uh, As you often ask us, what is our mind... What is my mind telling me, right? Yeah. Why am I seeing that? And you've, well, often, you've often told us that a dream will give you... The dream master gives you no more or, or less than you need. Yeah, well, let's just stay with this for a moment. But the reason I say that is because this is such a sparse... Well, I didn't notice that. <laughs> uh, by the way, um, can you use the language of self? <laughs> Did you see the dog out of self? Yes. Then what are you seeing? A certain perfection in the way he's functioning? Self he, looking at self. Self looking at self, isn't it? And being himself. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Can you risk that or not? When you say being himself, yeah. both selves are being himself? Yeah. Yes. I, the observer, am being myself, and he's certainly being himself or yeah. herself. And are you enjoying looking at but that? I'm not sure he knows I'm watching. That's okay. Then you're in separate realms. <laughs> yeah. No. Why is that? Uh, I'm not sure, but uh, do you normally uh, see dogs as uh, carrying an image of a self? Do I normally see dogs as carrying what? Uh, I think you use the word self. Do you normally look at dogs and say, oh yeah, they got a self? Actually, lately, all the time. Oh. It's fairly, I mean, it's, in, anybody who has ever had pets knows, well, I shouldn't say that, any philosophers who have yeah. had pets <laughs> can certainly see it. So, you're saying the self? In, oh. in, the, in the world of animals, pets, right? Why? I don't know why. I, that's a question that we hold up for. Um, <clears throat> would you agree as you reflect, you're seeing more and more perfection in the image that you gave in the dream? What are you bringing to this reflection? Come on. What comes to mind is, uh, this was just this morning. Yesterday I had a talk with my superior <laughs> <laughs> and it was a pretty uh, intense talk 
Um, and um, because the reason I did this is we've been doing midwife talks and it's quite apparent that uh, I need to confront him yeah. as part of my work yeah. and tell him what I see yeah. regardless of how he responds. Yeah. And I, I did, but I was unhappy with the job I did after it was over and I drove home more and more angry. Mm. And I saw, the more I reflected on it, I saw that really I had begun to do it, but I had not prepared for it. And in the end, he still controlled the conversation and walked away happy. And I realized that I had not used my mind to mm. really fathom deeply enough mm -hmm. what it is and how he's functioning. Yeah. So I thought about it for three or four more hours after I got home and I wrote a document I gave you six pages mm. long. I worked on for hours and went to sleep. But I, at the end of that time, it, it became apparent to me exactly what he is, the philosophy that he holds, and every single puzzle that I had fell into place as part of this, mm. the role that he's playing, and mm -hmm. he doesn't see it himself, and what I really need to say to him. Um, and in a sense, he's a dog. Yeah. Um, but in a sense, that's also okay. I but, mean, in a uh, sense, he needs to go through what he's doing. That's true. But the, the dog is not seeing you. That's right. He absolutely, and that was the problem for the last six years in my job. Right. He's a dog. He may be okay where he's, where he's at and doing what he's, he's doing. But. He's happy being down there playing around with the bottom of that damn pole. He's just, shall we put it in a slogan? <laughs> he's just pissing off. He is. That's what he's doing. <laughs> but the, what was beautiful about it, I think, was the last midwife talk I had with you. And the thing is, you don't see until you see. That's and you right. can't see... You can't really see until you clear out your own windshield. That's right. And then everything becomes apparent and yeah. easier. Yeah. By the way, everything you've said, did you see that in the original statement of the dream? Or is it by reflection that all of this has come out? Only by reflection. So, yeah. And that's what you're saying about this gentleman that you're related to. It took reflection. It took no, a good deal of it, but it wasn't painful to do it. No. Um, <laughs> I avoid it, but it, I tend to avoid reflection okay. for obvious pathologous reasons. Right, right. But when you do it, you really you get a unity on things. Good show. Such a good unity that you can produce an image that is so clean and has only the things necessary. Right, right. And but especially then, here, you see, the dog has no interest in you. The dog has no interest in me. And that's like your boss. He, if can I may be, he can be very knowledgeable in his field, right? But what does he lack? He doesn't see you. Yeah. And I, I spent years needing because of what I obtained from both parents, in this case, particularly on my father's side, I spent years trying to get the dogs to see me. No, and you. I realize now it doesn't matter. You don't have to. Don't have to. It's his problem. Yeah, very nice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> How about another one? Let's go. After you, after her. Is this your, somebody's got one in it. Is this your Brad? No coffee? Mine. Okay. July 4th. July 4th, <clears throat> Woo! This guy had been, this guy had been traveling and he bought a new car mm. and he made, so there's two guys, there's one well-to-do guy and he had been off traveling and they were in this, 
like, uh, what do they call those things that they ship cars in? Uh, just the empty vessel thing. Like okay. Sparse. Um, yeah, one it, of the road carriers? One of the... Or that they ship, like, all the uh, crate, not a crate. Cargo? Cargo, yeah. Cargo yeah. thing. Like. Okay, go ahead. So he had been all over the place, and he had bought he had bought a new car, and um, I was saying, isn't it? He had been to the east, somewhere in the east, and I said, isn't it interesting? It's a nice state of mind. He had been to somewhere in the east, and he made a Mediterranean plate, and then. I tasted it, and it was really good. And that's the dream. I can go over it again. Go ahead. I'll just read it. This guy had been traveling. He had bought a new car, and he made this Mediterranean plate. Before, I said, <clears throat> before he made the Mediterranean plate, I said, isn't it interesting, a nice state of mind? What, what, what? Yeah. Say it again. I said, isn't it interesting, a nice state of mind? In his traveling, I meant. Like, going over there and seeing what he saw. And your comment was? Isn't it a nice state of mind? To doing that. Yeah, in particular, like, a different state of mind, a nice state of mind. Yeah. yeah. Did you see that in him? No. Oh. I was more imagining. Oh, you were adding. Like, And it's different than here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I happen to be very good at drawing cars. Um, now, notice what you're doing. Go ahead, say it again. You're now telling him. Isn't it a nice state of mind being over there? It's such a puzzling dream to me. And what does he say? Well, he doesn't say anything. He hands, he, all of a sudden, right before me, is this, like, Mediterranean plate. So he's then offering you a Mediterranean plate. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And, and uh, I, I, it was very bright. He's kind of doing what I say, in a sense, right? Like, it was very bright, like this pink and Mediterranean, right? Like, and fresh and instantaneous. It was like, bloop! Here went this plate out of nowhere, kind of. Now, the thing you're talking about is the Mediterranean plate. Yeah. And then you taste, taste it, it, right? And? It sent me. <laughs> it was... Sent me? Come on. It, uh... Yeah, it, 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 it was outstanding. It was so fresh and, and colorful and uh, delicious. I wouldn't even use the word delicious. So, um, that's the dream. Yeah. yeah what am I going to ask? And you? it's coming out of this. Of course. Yeah. No, no. What do you make of it? I don't know. I'm like, sh well. Mm. 
It's interesting, and it's been on my on my mind. Come on, come on. Do I have to ask you a question? What's it? What about him? Talk about him. Or what's it like when I taste it? Or what do I make of what's going on? <laughs> I like the last one. What's going on? I don't. These are two states of mind. Compare them. When you said, isn't it a nice state of mind, right? Being over there. Being yeah. over there. With the dishes and the cafe right. and the right. right color. Right. What's that like when you're saying that? Come on. I'm curious if he's like if he experienced that, if he if he saw that, no. like, did you see that? No. Did you experience that? No, yeah. no, 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 no. The difference. No. Therefore, what's the dream telling you? I'm wondering about, I don't know, I don't know, <laughs> yeah. So, when you were in two, that's when you were tasting, right? right. You forgot all about number one. Everything disappeared. Everything disappeared. Yeah, I went, it Thank took you. me zooming right. off. Right, like. <laughs> that's right, gone. Yeah. And then this new thing came in. Right? What do you call that? Wait, what new thing? The well, the number one, your comments yeah. and your wondering yeah. ended. It's gone. Now no, no, I was talking about when I tasted the food. I was, I, I, like, it did something to yeah. me. Yeah. Yes, I agree. But yeah. it wiped out your thought. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's why I say it's gone. Yeah. Right. Oh. Everything else was, yeah. Right, right, right. right. Yeah. What shall we call that dream? Sir, did you give up your question? And got caught up in dainty, dainty food? <laughs> Um, did I? Did you? That's what it says. Did you not want an answer to this? Yeah, but I was wondering if he's actually, is he answering it? No. Well, By. do you call that an answer? Isn't it a nice state of mind over there? He's sharing, like... The same thing or different? Oh, okay. Then I'll go along with you. Then when he gave you that uh, Mediterranean food that solved everything you thought about before, therefore no. it's a success. No? No. No. Dainty food. Did you give up your question? Yes. What do you think of that, sir? That's not good. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. What happened on July 3rd or 4th? Come on. July 3rd. Did you give up a damn good question about someone and settled for How does this fit the preceding day? I, I was studying the Parmenides. What happened? Really, it was good, really good. And in the morning. What happened? 
Oh, yeah, I got involved in something. Oh, what was the thing? <laughs> no, I just... Did the thing you get involved, I don't need to know. Yeah. But did the thing you get involved in wipe out? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you think of that? <clears throat> no, yeah, that's not mm -hmm. <laughs> Right. This was going someplace. Yeah, in a big way. In a big way. Yeah. Finish it, because? It was profound. Yeah. Right. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have one? I don't. Uh, let me see. Uh, yeah, we we'll do this tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. okay. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Pleasure. Thank you. Okay, I'm taking um, donations over here. <laughs> <laughs>